Hello. How are you? Hey, Galaxy, it tell me one. Okay. One, how are you? Hi, teacher. I'm fine. Thank you. How about you? I'm fine. Thank you. Good evening, Sochi. Mm -hmm. It's okay, Juan. Sochi sigue mal de la garganta. No puede hablar, solo puede chatear. Ah, ok. Como espectadora nada más. Sí, no te imaginas cómo me encantaría que fuera mi esposa. No puede hablar, solo... <risa> bueno. Así que... Qué suerte, qué suerte. <risa> bueno. Eh, Juan, ¿qué hiciste hoy? ¿Qué hiciste hoy, Juan? Mm, I I work and I work a little. You work a little. Uh, work, yes, work. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, in the park with the with your dog. In where did you work? Uh, in the park. In the park, I, I was uh, one moment to the park. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes. And one only you in the park, or with a friend, or with the the with your animal my friends. Ah, okay. With with my coworker. Okay. Do you play basketball or do you play soccer? Mm, yes, I play uh, basketball and soccer too. Ah, okay, okay, good, okay. And René, what did you do today? Hi. Hi. I'm work today. Ah, today you worked. Yeah. At what time, René? What time did you work? The eight o'clock. Eight o'clock. And you finish? What time, Rene? Five o'clock. Mm -hmm. A complete day, huh? Yeah. And your job, Rene, is difficult, so so, or easy? Yeah, very difficult. Very difficult. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Good. And Victor, what did you do today? Good evening. Excuse me. Can you repeat the question? Yes. What did you do today? Honestly, I be at home all day. <laughs> you, yes, because, listen, Rene. Yeah. Listen, at home all day, Victor. I yes, I working hard. <laughs> it's it's kind of complicated because Rene and I we are co-workers, and also today I have to go to a, a specific place in El Salvador, but it's really dangerous. It's really it's really this risky, mm -hmm. and also and also we have troubles to be at to be there, so that's why reason I had to call all my customers and ask what they what they want for for tomorrow, make a make make different orders, but I did by telephone or by WhatsApp because I can be there because it's really dangerous. Oh, okay. Okay. In they are like in San Salvador, in the center, or in our Japan, or, or, or... it's in Soyapango Soya downtown. Oh, okay. 
But today is dangerous, right? Today I see a, a lot of activities. See, but in our case is is always it's, it's different. It's different because there is a many many situation, but mm -hmm. the most important is about the company. Is it's, it's about different topic. Ah uh, yes, yes. If this so that is the reason. No problem, my friend, my friend, not this, mm. and you, and you, ah. Uh -huh. So that's why they told me, Victor, I don't want to see you here, there. I, I don't want to see you here. Just a specific person. of the company all day in WhatsApp message make taking different orders. Okay. Okay. Victor, the your internet is like a, is stop. Okay, there it goes, Victor. The internet, a little bit yes, a little bit no. Okay, good. Now, today, we are going to continue the topic from yesterday. Yesterday, the topic was WH questions. Remember? Yesterday, we had WH questions. What? Where? How? Okay. Hi, everyone. In this class, you'll learn... I'm a doctor. Okay. So remember, where is for location? Where, location or place? What was the profession, right? The job and how is the emotion? Ah, do you like, you don't like, it's not good, it's not good. This is how, right? So today we are going to practice with our partners, right? We are going to. How do you like it? I really one, like it. One right here, three point seven. So, with a partner, we are going to complete the conversation. As an example, okay. What does your sister do? Ah, and then you put my sister. Ah, the answer. You have to know the difference. What, where, or how? And with the partner, you select which answer is correct. 3.7. See, today we make two groups. Um, let me see. You guys, you ready? Any questions? 3.7? And let me put here. No te pudiste unir.
Hello Anna. Hola. Good night. Uh -huh. Good. Remember. Good. Uh, ahorita me acabo de conectar. It's okay, no problem. Igual José, igual no, no problem. Ok. Eh, sí, ando perdida. No sé qué tema estamos viendo. <laughs> ok, 3.7. 3.7. Mm -hmm. Okay, ahorita lo. Yes, in this moment we are in 3.7 in the platform. Okay, we are mm -hmm. going to check the answers. Okay. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we have, okay, here we have number one. The correct is how does she like it? How does she like it? It's difficult, uh -huh. but she loves it because it's how is for description. And here is the emotion, the description, right? Okay. Number number two, where does your brother work? The location, the place at the airport. He's a pilot. Mm -hmm. Next. Oh. Uh, how does he like it? Uh, he doesn't really like it. It's because it's the description, the emotion, the feeling. Mm -hmm. Conversation three. How do your parents like their jobs? Oh, I guess they like them. Because it's, again, the description for the feeling. Then, mm -hmm. oh, I don't remember. Where do they work? Uh, in an office in the city so in where the city. do they work the this is for the place or the mm -hmm. location and the last conversation uh i am a student is the profession right uh, so what do you do and the last is i see how do you like your classes they're good i like them a lot we are talking about your feelings for them. This is the correct one for using where, what, and how. Where for place, what for things, and how for emotion. Today, mm -hmm. we're going to continue looking at adjectives and how to use adjectives, okay? We have two forms. We use adjectives with is, and we use adjectives with nouns. Oh. So I put in the chat, okay? So you can Thank put you. as an example. Okay. You can have a doctor's job, for example, is stressful, okay? Or you can put a doctor has a stressful job. Okay. Sure. Si usamos el verbo be, is, are, or am, vamos a poner el adjetivo después. The doctor's job is exciting, is stressful, is boring. Cualquier adjetivo. Si usamos mm -hmm. has, vamos a poner el Descripción y después lo que estamos hablando de, por ejemplo, a doctor has a stressful job, an exciting job, a boring job. Okay. Okay. This is the idea. We're going to watch a video for different adjectives and how to make it. Okay. Here, this is 3.9, how to use the adjectives. Adjectives, particularly, okay. you will learn be. Yes. Yes. Yes, Anna? Yes, thank okay. you. You're welcome. Plus adjective and noun plus adjective. Let's get started by listening to a conversation title. That's exciting. Let's listen and practice. Hey, Stephanie, I hear you have a new job. 
Yes, I'm teaching math at Lincoln High School. How do you like it? It's great. The students are terrific. How are things with you? Not bad. I'm a firefighter now, you know. That's exciting. Yes, but it's a very stressful job, and sometimes it's dangerous. In essence, what we want to learn is how to express the same thing, but in different ways. First, let's analyze the examples on the left-hand side of this chart, B plus adjective. We can follow this formula to better understand this topic. Article A. Okay. Y aquí prácticamente lo que está enseñando es explicando lo que le dije. Okay. That cuando estamos hablando de la profesión, vamos a usar apostrophe S. Es a firefighter's job, a doctor's job. Si nos fijamos, es aquí apostrophe S. Porque el trabajo de un bombero, el trabajo de un doctor, eso es el apostrophe S. Entonces, ese es firefighter's job, doctor's job. Y como usamos el verbo to be, vamos a poner el adjetivo después. Is dangerous, is stressful, is exciting. Ok. Aquí podemos ver el otro. Ok. Por ejemplo, a doctor's job is stressful. Right. Ahora, si no usamos is, si usamos este que está a la derecha, el has, entonces sería un poco diferente. Ok. It's going to be tu, 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 here. Por ejemplo, ya va a ser en vez de is, vamos a tener a firefighter. Ya no tenemos el apostrofe S, sino que vamos a tener has. A firefighter has a, y después la descripción, a dangerous job. A firefighter has Now, I would like to give you some job. adjectives. Okay. ¿Y cuáles son los adjetivos? Aquí vamos a tener algunos que podemos usar. Por ejemplo, boring. Easy, dangerous, exciting, difficult, and stressful. ¿Entienden qué significa todos estos adjetivos? Solo tengo una duda con stressful. Ah, estresante. Stressful, estresante. El segundo. Okay, thank you. Eh, boring. El, oh, oh, el, perdón, el easy. No, el, ah, perdón, el primero sería. Ah, ok. Boring. Boring es aburrido. Boring. Uh, thank you. Ab aburrido. Uh -huh, you're welcome. The others, ok. Ok, entonces, ¿qué vamos a hacer? Bueno, en este momento vamos a hacer dos cosas. Primero, vamos a practicar la conversación de Richard y Stephanie, ¿verdad? Una vez Richard, después la siguiente vez Stephanie. Eso es lo importante. Para poder practicar eso, primero, ¿hay alguna palabra aquí que no conocen? Any questions for the vocabulary? Yeah, la, la última palabra de, de Richard, la que dice Dan Harris. Ah, muy bien. Se pronuncia dangerous. 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 ¿Alguien sabe qué significa dangerous? Peligroso. Excelente, René. Peligroso. Very good. Dangerous. Ok. Entonces, lo primero es Richard y Stephanie y después Stephanie y Richard. Y lo segundo es que vamos a describir las diferentes profesiones. Por ejemplo, nuestro trabajo o, trabajo, o profesiones que conocemos. Que es, entonces, por ejemplo, yo puedo poner, ah, a teacher has a, a difficult job. Ah, perfecto. O a, a teacher's job is difficult. ¿Verdad? Porque las dos formas significan lo mismo. Ok, podemos hablar de las dos formas. A firefighter's job is dangerous. A firefighter has a dangerous job. Entonces, ¿cómo lo vamos a hacer? Primero vamos a practicar la conversación y después vamos a ir a 
3.10, tenemos la oración, ok, a doctor's job is interesting, y nosotros tenemos que escribir la otra forma de decir esta misma oración, a doctor has an interesting job. It's okay. Practice the conversation and then write. Any questions or no? No questions. Oh, no questions. Okay. Let's try. La invitación, por favor. ¿Perdón? Me podrían dar la invitación de nuevo, por favor. Ah, claro, claro. Ok. <coughs> José, ¿está teniendo dificultad también?
Okay, you ready? Yes, I'm ready. Okay, let's check the answers. So, let's see. Okay. Uh, number two, Rene, go ahead. I don't understand. Uh, I write the as police officer has job. Job is stressful. Uh, so no. so, no. A police a police officer, Victor, help help the police. Me. Mm -hmm. A police officer has a dangerous job. Uh huh. Dan because here we use dangerous. So a police officer has a dangerous job. Ah, okay. So vamos a modificar el has. El has. Le vamos a quitar la s y le vamos a poner. Uh -huh, ahí. A police officer has a dangerous job. We're going to see in one moment. Mm -hmm. Don't worry. Okay. Okay. Francisco, try number three. A teacher has is a stressful. Uh, has a stressful job. job. Al final va a ir job. Uh, a teacher has. Uh -huh. A teacher has. Jory uh, es stressful. No puedo pronunciar el. Stressful. Stressful. Uh -huh. Sería, a teacher has a stressful job. A stressful job. Mm -hmm. Okay. Ana Melara, try number four. A Bloomberg has. Mm -hmm. a, a boring. A boring job. A boring job. Va a ir job al final. Okay. Okay, we're going to see. Okay. Silvia, try number five. 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 Mm -hmm. And electric, electricist, sería, pero no, electric, no sé si cómo se pronuncia. Electrician has a difficult job. Okay, good. An electrician has a difficult job. Very good. And the last one, number six. Can get intentar number six? Yo. Okay, go ahead, Juan. Okay. Uh, a vendor. A vendedor has a easy job. Okay. Good. Así sería. Okay. Let's take a look. Okay. Cuando lo escriben, hay diferentes formas de escribirlo. Pero todas estas son las que están aceptadas por la computadora de este formato. Right? A police officer has a dangerous job. Ok. Lo pueden poner con punto, sin punto, lo van a aceptar. Si la letra A va mayúscula o minúscula, se lo va a aceptar en este caso. Estas son todas las formas que están, pero la idea es, a police officer has a dangerous job. A teacher has a stressful job. Se fijan que siempre al final va a ir job, porque tenemos que no solo poner la descripción, no podemos decir police officer has a dangerous. Tenemos que describir qué, qué es peligroso. Okay, qué es estresante. En este caso, job. Yeah. A plumber has a boring job. Okay. An electrician has a difficult job. And the last one, a vendor has an easy, an easy job. It's okay all of the vocabulary. ¿Saben qué significa todos los uh, trabajos, todos los adjetivos? 
Yes. Ok, perfect. Eh, ¿Qué sería la diferencia entre salesperson and vendor? Salesperson y vendor. Porque vendor está en la número 5. Perdón, la número 6. A vendor. Ok. Sochi dice que vendedora. Ok. Ok. Es, los dos son vendedores para español, pero son diferentes en inglés. A salesperson es la persona que te convence a comprar algo, el vendedor que te convence. Por ejemplo, vas a comprar un carro, eso es un salesperson. Vas a ir a comprar ropa, la persona que te trata de convencer que compres eso, eso es salesperson. Un vendor es un vendedor que no necesita vender su producto. Solo ofrece ese producto. Por ejemplo, eh, los mangos, la minuta, choripanes, cocos. Esos son vendedores. Los que se suben en el bus. Esos son vendors. Salesperson son los que trabajan en Simán, los que trabajan en la Curazao, los, de, los que trabajan en diferentes lugares que te convencen a comprar el producto. Right? Los que trabajan para el que compren el paquete de Cameron para toda la familia. Ese es salesperson. El vendor tiene el producto. La gente llega donde él. ¿Es ok? Yes. Yes. Ok. Good. Very good. Excellent. Then we continue. Perfect. Now we're going to look at the reading. Ya lo mandé al WhatsApp por si acaso. Vamos a ver job profiles. ¿Alguien tiene idea qué puede significar job profiles? Como Hi, perfil everyone. laboral. Perfil, perfil laboral o perfil de trabajo. Exacto, eso es. Perfil laboral o perfil de trabajo. Excelente. Ok. Vamos a escuchar un poquito las conversaciones. Bueno, la lectura de cuatro diferentes profesionales. Ok. Listen to the pronunciation. Listen to the pronunciation. In this class, you'll develop prediction and inferencing skills after reading and discussing an article on job profiles. Reading. Job profiles. Lisa Parker has job two profiles. jobs. She works as a waitress at night, but she's really an actress. During the day, she auditions for plays and television shows. Her schedule is difficult, and she's tired a lot, but she's following her dream. Lots of teenagers want John Blue's job. He plays video games for eight hours a day, and he gets paid for it. John is a video game tester for a big video game company. Is it ever boring? Never. John almost always wins. Becky Peck walks in the park every day for many hours, rain or shine. Becky is a professional dog walker. She walks dogs for other people. Sometimes she takes 20 dogs to the park at one time. Carlos Ruiz is a busy man. He plans lessons, grades homework, helps with after-school activities, and, of course, he teaches. His salary isn't great, but that's okay. His students like his class. So he's happy. Okay. First, any vocabulary, any words you don't know? ¿Alguna palabra que no conocen o no están seguros cómo se pronuncia? Get by. Get by. Sí, John Blue. Ok, let's see, John Blue. Mm. Get 
Tickets page on. La tercera oración. And he gets paid for it. John is a video game. It's paid for it. Oh. ¿Cuál, cuál, es, ¿Cuál es la que querías? Gets, gets paid? No. Sí. Sí. Ah, okay. Esa. Esa, ok. Ok. He gets paid for it. Ok. Le pagan por eso. Es decir, él, él recibe, gets, recibe pago por eso. He gets paid for it. Uh -huh. Money. Yes, receive <laughs> money. Exactly. <laughs> the other words okay? Teacher, la que dice en la, en la, en la primera, del primer párrafo, la Lisa Parker, o dice her is Schedule, algo así, ¿es schedule. correcto? Schedule. ¿Sabe qué significa schedule? No, esa es la duda. Ok, horario. Oh, horario, okay. schedule. <coughs> ok, ¿alguna otra pregunta? Eh, la, la otra la que dice por por following algo así dice no, siempre en el mismo párrafo la following uh, following 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 her dream siguiendo following es siguiendo her dream okay. su sueño following her dream siguiendo uh -huh. Solo esas. Ok. Perfecto. Ok, excelente. Entonces, ¿qué vamos a hacer? En este momento con el compañero lo vamos a leer. Vamos a estar seguros que nos quede claro. Y vamos a contestar aquí. 3.13. 3.13. Para poder hacerlo más grande, lo pueden hacer así, el pop-up, y lo pueden hacer bien grande, como el zoom, o aquí mismo lo pueden hacer más grande, aquí solo lo van moviendo la sección, ¿ok? ¿Y qué es lo que tienen que hacer? Lee la oración, after I win, I take a break, y ¿quién, dije, quién va a decir eso? ¿O quién dijera eso? Y aquí vamos a practicar con el compañero... Yo voy a leer uno, mi compañero va a leer otro. Yo voy a leer el otro y mi compañero va a leer el otro. ¿Ok? Entonces, dos. No solo contestar, sino que leer en voz alta y después contestar. Leer en voz alta cada uno. ¿Ok? Let's go.
What happened, Victor? I left the group because nobody else was reading and I feel bored. So that's uh -huh. what I leave. Sylvia didn't read or nobody? No. No, nobody. Nobody. Okay. Okay. So that's what I left. No problem. Let's try together then. Perfect. Okay. Here we have it. Okay. okay. Let's go with the four. Who is going to read Lisa Parker? Lisa Parker, no? Can I? Okay, Victor, read Lisa Parker. Lisa Parker has two jobs. She works as a waitress at night, but she really, but she really an actress. During the day, she auditioned for plays and television shows. Her schedule is difficult and she's tired a lot, but she is following her dream. Okay, good, very good. Remember to pronounce the S, she's and auditions. Good job, okay. Who's going to read John Blue? Gran temor que tienen a leer, okay. <laughs> oh, okay. Who's going to read John Blue? No tenga temor. Lo malo, lo van a pronunciar mal y que es tú, ya es tú. Bye, teacher, vamos a ayudar, pues. Excellent. Okay, go ahead. Bye, ahí, ahí, me, ahí me corrige ahí después porque vamos a hacer el intento, ahí va. Excelente. Load, load of painter want John Blue it. It's Joe. He played video game for eight hours a day and he had pay for it. John is a video game sensor for a big video game company. It it is it, it ever boring. Never John almost Always win. Ok, good, good. Eso, excelente el intento. Muy bien. Vamos a corregir algunas palabras. Por ejemplo, la primera, lots. Lots. Lux. Ok, Lux. Con, con S al final, lots. Lux. Como que si fuera culebra, lots. 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 Excelente, lots. Muy bien. Después vamos a ir aquí. La otra Teacher, la, yes. la, la, la segunda palabra, lots of tenor, tenor, ah, ¿cómo se pronuncia? Esta, esta, la tercera, esta, teenager, 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 ajá, vamos a ir, teen, que es la primera parte, teen, ne, ne, jers, jers, teenager, excelente, así es, teenagers, Mm -hmm. Major. Good. Major. Then we have paid. Paid. Con, pay. Pay, con una D más fuerte. Paid. Pay. Pay. No, no pa, pa P, P. La, solo la letra P. Como si estás diciendo en español. P. Paid. 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 Okay. okay. Good. Or, Good. Okay. Y aquí solo al final vamos a hacer boring. Boring. Excellent. Boring. Excellent. Okay. Good. Bye. ¿Quién quiere, ¿Quién quiere practicar el Becky Peck? Voy ahí. Okay. Maudi. Becky Peck uh -huh. works in the park every day for many hours. Rain or shine. Becky is a professional dog worker. She works dogs for other people. Sometimes she takes uh, 20 dogs the, to the park at one time. Okay. Okay. Good job. Very good job. Okay. Here we have good. 
the pronunciation rain or shine rain or shine ah okay, okay. good rain or shine yes rain yeah. or shine okay and here the park park park, park. muy bien muy bien all right who's going to read carlos ruiz Me. Okay, Juan. He's a busy man. He plans lesson, lessons, great homework, great homework, help with after school activities. And of course, he teaches. His salary isn't great, but that's okay. His students like his class, so he's happy. Correct. Al final, solo al final, happy. Happy. Good, very good. Okay, nice. Ahora vamos a contestar juntos para estar seguro. ¿Quién va a decir, after I win, I take a break? Mm. John Blue. John Blue. Okay. John Blue. ¿Quién va a decir? I don't usually work in the summer. Carlos Ruiz. Carlos Ruiz. Okay. Who is going to say the restaurant closes late around 2 a.m.? Lisa. Lisa Parker. Lisa Parker. And who is going to say? After work, my feet and my arms are tired. Becky. Becky. Okay. Becky Peck. Excellent. Very good. All of those answers are correct, I believe. Okay. Any questions? No. No. Okay. Now, remember that <clears throat> excellent okay today we finish section one section three section three so now we have an exam you can do the exam today tomorrow saturday sunday okay or monday <laughs> <laughs> <Cualquier Bien bendecido. laughs> i decide en cualquier día Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Uh, tiene un montón de días. Pero tienen hasta el lunes. La idea es que no dejen para que así tengan varios días para poder hacerlo. Ok. Now, no lo tienen que hacer de un solo. Pueden hacer. Está diseñado para que si quieren hacer una sección. Ok. Lo hacen una. Tomen descanso. Hacen la siguiente y así. The first section. Section A is listening. Listening, simplemente les recomiendo que primero, antes de, leer, antes de escuchar, lean las preguntas. Siempre lean las preguntas y las respuestas, porque cuando escuchan se les hace más fácil tratar de identificar porque ya lo han leído. Ok. This is listening. In section B, section B is complete the conversation. Solo van a elegir cuál, lo que hemos visto anteriormente. ¿Cuál es el que va con do, o does, o don't? Ok. Acuérdense. He, she, it, does. He, she, it, does. Aquí es unscramble the sentence. O sea que la oración no está en el orden correcto. Simplemente tienen que agarrar las mismas palabras y poner la oración correctamente. En orden correcto. Eso es unscramble the sentence. Then we have select the word. Este es vocabulario, profesiones, trabajos. Van a leer en la profesión que trabaja en ese lugar o que hace esa acción. Okay. One, two, and three. Professions and activities. Then in section E is here is the answer and you select the question. Here is the answer and you select the question. So only is necessary, select the question. And the last section here is 
lo que practicamos hoy. Vas a usar have, vas a usar has, is, vas a usar, ok. ¿Cuál palabra, cuál forma sería la correcta? Is, has, have, that's it. Ok, así que ya deben estar terminado o al día con la plataforma, la unidad 3 y tienen todo el fin de semana para hacer el examen de la unidad 3. ¿Es ok? Yes. Ok. Ok, good. Have a nice weekend. I see you on Monday. Ok, okay. see you on Monday. See you on Monday. Bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Good night. Good night. Bye. 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 Bye.